Elon Musk, richest man in the world and our favorite lesbian stepdad needs to run <laughs> Twitter and not the Saudi royal family and here's why. First of all, Elon is the GOAT, which is clearly why the Saudis are trying to fuck him. I mean, do we really want Weekend at Burning Yemen calling the shots at Twitter? This Saudi prince that looks like Wario just sniffed a little girl's bicycle seat rejected Elon's offer to buy Twitter. He said Elon's offer, which was 38% above the stock price, was too little. What? This guy must be dropping acid, and I'm not talking about on women trying to drive. <laughs> <laughs> also, of course Saudi Arabia doesn't want Elon owning it, okay? They're furious at him. Self-driving is a loophole to put women behind the wheel. Wow. We cannot <laughs> let the Saudis control Twitter, okay? It won't last. They have a history of crashing things after hijacking oh them. Oh, my God. Now, <laughs> wow. we need Elon to buy Twitter, okay? It's something we can all agree with. A rich Saudi African is trying to own something that's not a person, that is progress. Wow. <laughs> Speaking of progress, woke people should want this, okay? We need more African American businesses. <laughs> not to mention, we should support marginalized groups, and right now, autistic African Americans are under attack. <laughs> Obviously, proud boys are on board. They'll be able to say the N-word without posing as a black teenager. That's right, <laughs> proud boys. You can type it the way you vote, with a hard R. Listen, <laughs> Elon's the bot for the job, okay? He's a diamond in the rough, and I'm not talking about oh, what he shit. mined as a child. Jeez. I mean, the <laughs> guy married a woman from another planet and had kids with her. He can do anything. Now, unfortunately, they broke up, so technically she's... Uh, I can't say. say it. Come on. Come I, on. I just can't say it. It's so corny. Cool. I need no, no, to hear it. It's so it. corny. I love corny. Do it. Technically, she's his... SpaceX. Hey! <laughs> Training porn, the greatest thing to ever happen. Okay, let me explain. This is Derek Poston, a hilarious stand up comedian that opens up for Schultz on the road. And as you can see, he's got some pretty wild takes. Denzel Washington is not that great of an actor. But before we get to that, this is why he hates New York. No, there's no black people in New York. Yeah. I did, wait, wait, I did, wait, there's no what? There's no black people in New York. Bro. No, wait, keep, keep talking. There's about no it. fat people in New York and there's yeah. no black people in New York. That's what I noticed. Hey. I see Alex. That's it. I've been all over this bitch, bro. There's no black people here. There's people that look like Dove is everywhere. <laughs> like, I've seen Dove five trillion times. <laughs> Did you just not leave Chelsea the whole time? He was yeah. Yeah. Bro, I, we was at radio. No, he's in Soho. Oh, he's in Soho. So I hit a story up. Oh, yeah, we you went to all the black areas. Yeah. So old. <laughs> story up. Yeah. No, I see it. Yeah, Wait till you go to Williamsburg. Go to Williamsburg, I went buddy. to Williamsburg. No, nigga. No black niggas. <laughs> yeah, there's no black people here. And there's no fat people. There's only a couple things I didn't like about this place. Now, now, is that surprising that there's no black people given all like the great black art that's come out of New York City? I thought it was all Marcy Projects. I what, thought the whole New York <laughs> yeah. was Marcy Projects okay. where Chris Rock and Jay-Z came from. Yeah. Were you and disappointed or relieved? Because <laughs> <laughs> you're scared to ride the subway. I can't imagine you're walking through Marcy like, I got this. Now, you know what? I, I'm, yeah, because I was more scared of the subway because of like all the stories. Like Jamil was like, "Oh, nigga, they push people on the third rail and don't pee down there, you'll get electrocuted." And he was saying a bunch of they, they, they yeah, walk yeah, up yeah, and yeah. they walk go. up and go, "What time Let's is go. it?" And they cut your face. And I was, like, that's Let's what he go. was saying. He was yeah. talking about the '90s with yeah. Andrew. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> now, when we were growing up, it was wild. Like it was wild. Like the, like I was remember being in middle school and then the the principal getting on the thing and going, "Hey everybody, if uh, anybody comes up to you and asks you for the time, do not tell them the time and just walk away." And uh, and then we were like, "Why? Why? 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 Why?" And the teacher had to find out why. And then the principal came back. Um, right now, there are people asking you for the time and then uh, slashing your face as you look at your watch. So just don't do that. Why? They know why? Gang initiation, the blood gang initiation. Yeah, we don't yeah. we don't do the gang shit right out here. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah I do it much better. Yeah, yeah, yeah just yeah, shoot yeah. a motherfucker. And, and, and don't get too close. Yeah. <laughs> it's also why we're rude to, to like strangers sometimes because it's like, are you going to do something bad to me, or do you want my money? You either mm. want my money or you're going to do something bad to me. Yeah. we Every time a person talked to us, like a little old lady asked for help, I was like, bro, this you, bitch get too close. Here's the thing. <laughs> in New York, you can't, you can't. <laughs> Dude, she was like 90 in age and I was like, it's about to be another video, bro. It's, it's about to be another video, dog. No, this bitch is saying something else. She wanted like, I don't know what she wanted. But man. The way you get help in New York is you look lost. If you look lost, New Yorkers will just come up to you and help you. 
So if you're like looking like this, you got a map or your phone, you just look confused. But if you start walking up to New Yorkers, we'll just ignore you or just walk away. I don't mean, don't be in my space. If you look lost, that's also the way to get robbed. Yeah, I know, bro. Yeah, I was thinking that. I'll walk around the tournament, nigga. I'll help you spend some money. You know what I'm saying? We'll help you support the residents of New York City. You know what I'm saying? That when Mark was in Chicago, and he's like this with his phone. He's like, I need directions to someone. Mark thinks he's a fucking anthropologist every time he's going in the hood. What do you mean? Trying to best best friends with every person he meets. Learn about their fucking day and their culture. This guy was two seconds away from taking his iPhone, bro. Yeah. We had to get him away from him. I didn't He was pulling Mark's jeans. He was like, oh, what kind of jeans are these? Like, he's like, seeing how tight they are. And Mark was like, nice. like, oh, bro, this is car hard. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to be racist. He came up to me, asked me if he, I could get directions. I gave him directions. And he didn't. He didn't what did he ask me. for directions to? He, he said, how do I get to the bus stop? <laughs> I said, go up here, go around Come the corner. On, I pulled out Come my on, phone. Bro. You're being racist thinking that he was going to steal my phone. Somebody tried to do that to me in New York, and I was like, he had a phone. I was like, use your phone. And this guy could have yeah. beat the shit out of me, but yeah. I was like, I'd rather get my ass kicked than get my phone took. Yeah, yeah exactly. You gotta make yeah, that bro. calculation. In the but second. why do you think he was gonna take my phone? That was racist that you guys he thought was gonna he was gonna, he was gonna take your he was shit. Definitely so why he was gonna take your shit? Because he, 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 he saw me. He saw me pull up. 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 He saw Alex hold me back. He saw Alex hold me back. He saw Andrew pull up. He's like, I can't rob this kid in front of his dad. <laughs> Humiliate him on take your kid to work day. Are you kidding me? <laughs> no, no, no. That was that was one of the stupidest things. It was also like the week of the Popeye spicy chicken sandwich, which has nothing to do with it. What does that have anything to do with it? No, that's a big week, bro. That's a big week. Black people were focused, that's bro. Ours. Like that motherfucker needed seven fifty for that Popeye spicy lying. chicken sandwich, I was lying. and you was about to give him his life. He didn't you ask was about to give him his He asked me where Popeye's, and that that was true. We was out like Easter Sunday, bro. Yeah. Best, bro. Just waiting online. Woo. Was fire, dog. <laughs> Chicago, too. Yeah, it was oh, crazy. Man. Another All thing right. I noticed about New York is this: I notice is everyone's dirty. Yo, chill out. Oh, stop. Everything's no like not in a crazy. bad way. I mean, you no, literally have shit on your face right now. I like what it. I got I on my like face. <laughs> <laughs> what I had on my face he was it dirt on his face. Was it foam? <laughs> All right, foam ain't <laughs> dirt. <laughs> no, no, bro. Even because we were walking around so, and I was like, bro, everybody here is clearly rich. But nigga, everybody's ankles is dirty and like everybody, you like, there's nobody fully clean, bro. When you get out the shower, you dirty a little bit. Oh, you definitely it's, didn't see white people. Bro, New York is dirty. Black people. Yeah, you yeah, definitely yeah. didn't see black people. No, no, yeah. They, we'll be a, lotion yeah. ankles, but that, like, That's one yeah. word fucked up, just for the record. Yeah. Uh, nah, bro. Everybody yeah. was a little bit of filth out here. I like it, though. It's grimy. <laughs> it's grimy. That's what I mean. Everybody, like, even the rich people that look like bougie was like, nah, nah, but this nigga look, his fingernails look dirty. You know what I mean? Like, everybody yeah. look dirty here. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. People want to look cool here, not rich. Yes, whereas coming from LA, everybody. Everybody want to look rich. Clean. Clean, crystal yeah, clean. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that's yeah, what I'm yeah. saying. That was you the difference. You also don't walk as much, so it's just not as dirty on the streets. You can just be crisp. That, Park the car, yeah. go to the thing, you're good. Yeah. You're not out. Everyone's out. Here, everybody's out. You're walking everywhere. You're on no the No black people. You didn't see any black people? Why? One. Bro. I didn't see one. I, I, I have a hard time believing you didn't see. <laughs> you were at the Radio one City black show. person at Andrew's Look show. Look in the mirror. Yeah, yeah, Look yeah, in the yeah, mirror. Yeah, it was a time. big audience. Where are you Who did this have? You a vampire, bro? I don't understand. <laughs> yeah, Astoria. Why were you in Astoria? Uh, Sam, my girl's friends live there from college. And so we stayed with them. Mm. And they had a nice spot. They had like a really nice spot. Oh, I thought you got set up in uh, Soho. We did, but I mean, I, you know, it's like $5 million a night uh. <laughs> for the rooms. Is it? You didn't get the Dove special? No, it was a busy week. Bro, oh, my gosh. Uh, it was a busy no. week. Uh, Dove, busy yeah, week. No, Dove, I hit shit, you up like Dove. four months ago, wow. dog, and we played it, wow. and you were like, you took away my special. A busy wow. week. Wow. Really? Wow. A busy week. A lot of people coming from Radio City, for the show of Radio City. Is that why? Dove. Is yeah. that why it's so busy? <laughs> Are you blaming <laughs> our shit. show? What did I do for you last night? You did everything. I'm not I'm just saying, like, in, in in this instance, that is what Hold happened. On, what, what did he do? What did he do? I hit him up, like, two months ago, and I yeah. was like... No, no, what did he do last night? What did he do last oh, night? Oh, he took me to the cellar. That shit was awesome. And he came out to the show at New York Comedy he Club. He took you to a comedy club? He took you to a comedy club? What you a took hero. him. You took him to the fucking yes. comedy club. Yeah, 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 yeah. You <laughs> can't go there without a comic. You just <laughs> hey, hey, radio city. Off, I know we've been up like that, bro. First off, the Uber's here is expensive as fuck. 
He paid. Yeah. He took me to the comedy club. Probably bro. on my fucking car. Oh, it's a business expense. <laughs> we going to comedy clubs. God damn it, Dove. That's it. There's no den- there's no denial from him. Dude, no, no, no. Nothing, nothing like, in the way of no, a I'm not true. I'm I let like, you have the joke, but no, I paid for that. And like he got the he had the wings. Good. Yeah, the yeah, wings are crazy. No, the wings are fire. The wings are the seller fire. No, no, I'm just saying he had to see the seller. They he and Sam had sets at uh at New York Comedy Club. Crush it, both of them. Sam Thank you. Shouts to New York Comedy Club. We've just only been seeing him do big theaters for this year, and then you see him in this intimate room, and he just that instant engagement off of the audience was just fire. Oh like, yeah, you, you crushed. Thank yeah, you, and nice then job, they had bro. to see yeah. uh, the temple. He got to see uh, the spot. Yeah, that's what oh, it yeah, felt like. That was your first time going to the cellar. That's what I was, it, that, it was a lot to me, bro. Because anybody it was like, pop in? I mean, it, it, we were sitting in the kitchen area, and just to see David Tell walk in was just like that's all I needed. Did you get to watch him? No, we, we couldn't get down there like to watch the show. You could take you him couldn't down. get it. You couldn't no, it get it. Between it, shows. Yeah, it, was and it was between shows. It's on Dove today. Huh? <sighs> Come on, Dove. It's on Dove today. Yeah, Come on, I'm Dove. Trying. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Come on, Dove. Why Dove. we work so hard? Dove was such a housewife. Oh, everyone's ganging up on me today. <laughs> 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 no one helps me around the house ever. No one helps clean up ever. <laughs> Especially you. Especially <laughs> 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 you. We have company coming. He said that with Sash too. Yeah. Mark hasn't responded to a text in a week. Let me just say. <laughs> looking at Miles, you're That's scaring Mark. me. <laughs> right? Everything's good? Okay. Um, Mark, what do we got going on today? Okay, man? just Talk real real quick feelings, no facts. The mask mandate on airlines has been officially overturned by a judge in Florida. People Florida, were celebrating. Dog. People were celebrating all over the country. Can I ask you a question about it? Why is it that a judge in Florida is able to do that? And what's interesting is that I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea why. <laughs> I just spoke to Mark. I just spoke to Mark. I'm like, bro, I don't know a lot about any of the stories today, so you're going to have to do it. He's like, I'm good. I research everything. <laughs> so, go for it. Why, why does this one judge in Florida have all to say what that bitch been doing for the last two years? Because Florida's the best. Dude. We run we know the whole it's the shit. Best. We run the whole shit. You don't That's run the whole happens. shit. That is. Stop talking out I mean, your mouth like that. The judge is the best. Nah. Miami's Miami's New York, lit. Like, a judge in New York overturned it, and then nah. the whole country said, nah. No. Fuck it. No. And then it was Miami's dope. The rest of y'all fuck animals, bro. The rest yeah. of y'all fuck animals. Animals dog. and cousins, bro. Animals. Yeah. 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 How did Florida not like get caught up in the Alabama shit? They got some of that. They do got the some of that. What are you talking about? Wait, who's who's who? Florida. Thank you. Yeah, but yes. you fucking that cousin. It's like, I ain't got much to say. Yeah, you know how fire your cousin has to be to nut in her breath? <laughs> a Miami bitch. <laughs> <laughs> also, I don't take any of this shit because I'm pretty sure incest is legal in New Jersey. Like it's like up here where you, you guys You making a case incest. for incest dogs? You, it's not, no. it's not it's, <laughs> You guys it's not, have incest being legal and in Florida it's not even legal they're it just happens. They're not incest. They're just Italian. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. He don't know about the Florida judge but he knows about incest. Yeah. Come on, sir. How would you even Google that that quick? What? The incest rules? Yeah. yeah. You just make that up. Long. No, I have it's, it's my homepage incest.com. He got a couple cousins he needs to look out for. You know? <laughs> 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 That's why he couldn't research the topics. You got to so, try to get a marriage through. I have one of my boys come to the show Show, man, I haven't seen him for so long, and I, I won't say his name because he got friends that listen to the podcast. He, you know, but uh, and it was so funny. He was like, you know how people think you're gonna talk about them on stage. I'm sure you guys yeah, see yeah, this, yeah, right? Yeah, and yeah. and I, we don't, but like it would be ridiculous. I would talk about my friend from high school that I haven't seen him in a decade. But but at the same time, you're worried. And he goes, man, I thought you were gonna tell that story. And I was like, what story? He goes, remember when I told you I, I lost my virginity to my second cousin? It didn't count. <laughs> And I go, what? He goes, he goes, well, yeah, it ain't count, bro. We was keeping it in the family. <laughs> <laughs> yo. Hey, so yo. He came back. He came back one summer. It was high school. And he comes back. He walks into my room. He goes, son, I ain't no virgin no more, son. And I was like, oh, shit, who you doing? He goes, yo, my second cousin. And I was like, what? And he didn't even know it was wrong until I told him, bro. Oh, my God. Jeez. What wow. number is it not wrong no more? Third. Third is negotiable. My boss said one more. Third is like, what's a third cousin? Come on. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know the numbers. How does that work? Like, yeah, come on now. Third is, is that's. That's How not far even, away is that? That's not even family at that Genetically, point. Genetically, I think first cousin is like 15%. What is, what is, what is first cousin? That's just your cousin. Yeah. yeah. yeah Second your cousin. cousin is your cousin. Your cousins, cousin? children, children, children. Third cousin is your cousin's children. Ch- yeah, yeah, fucking great, great granddaddy. No, but. or like uh. your cousin, me, my cousin, or our kids mm-hmm. are cousins. If we're cousins, mm-hmm. 
Does that make sense? No, that wouldn't make any sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Cousins, cousins that you're not related to. If you're not at the family reunion, I'm fucking, dog. Get out of here. You got <laughs> well, to they are. Yeah, that's what I'm well, saying. Well, then I'm not. What if they have plus one, though? Yeah, oh, yeah, but hold Yeah, what do you mean? Hey, can we be honest? <laughs> yeah. family, family reunion mad inclusive. Can we yeah, be honest? No, it's a very inclusive event. Yo, that's oh a good ad. Like, you invite your whole family to them the Indian wedding. My wife coming. went to the family reunion. You know what I mean? She came and hung out. Wait, your family reunion? Yeah, she came to our family reunion. Okay. Well, you so, married, bro. Yeah, let's yeah, not no. put wives in it. So that's, my, that's my point. Hey, but by hey, your stop, rule, it disqualifies. We're talking about fucking cousins. Stop bringing yeah. up wives. <laughs> no, you're making but no, it weird. His rule is that if they go to the family reunion, you can't fuck. But it's like, yo, your girl's going to go to the family reunion. Yeah, that's it. Andrew's you know I mean? question is the plus one. Like, but I'm talking about, one. yeah, the plus ones, obviously, because yeah. that's not blood. Yeah. But what would you smash if you had a little of the same blood? I think third cousin is a good, honestly. Third cousin, right? I think that's fair. Al, third cousin. How much of the same I mean, blood is that, third cousin? Can we look, no, up, can zero, we look that up? Zero blood. Duff, can you bring up your 23 and me and just tell us? <laughs> can you just tell us really quickly how you're related to everybody <laughs> in Morocco? Uh, wait, what, uh, cut this, what, what? Oh, man. My grandfather. Oh, here we go. <laughs> my here we go. Here we go. Oh. Al got to explain his autism. You saved his autism. Tell him, Al. Tell him, I'm I'm tell him where I'm the gonna... tism come from, Al. Let's go, baby. Nah, nah, I, I never <laughs> did. I never did. But it was, it was my grandfather's uh, funeral. Okay. And so just family started coming out the woodwork. I think this motherfucker had family that I just didn't know about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that was just a baddie there. Like me and all my first cousins were looking at, like just wondering how related yeah, are right, we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's your last name? Yeah. Like we really like asking a lot of questions. Wow, bro, it's not that it's Anybody not that much smash? Blood. Al, anybody smash? Nah. No? Nah, nah, nah. You bagged her number? No. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> yeah. So a parent and a sibling got 50% same genetics. Okay. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yep. A first cousin is only 12.5. That's what I'm saying. Okay, low. so then second cousin is? Second cousin is 3.2. Third cousin, that's a stranger. 0. Yeah. 0.78. Third cousin, you're clear, dog. Yeah. That's less, that's 1%. What's the difference between us and chimpanzees? 1%, right? Probably, yeah. 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 So. I don't know what point you're yeah, making here. Yeah, I was like, like keep going. No, but I'm having fun, though. I'm just saying, if you fuck your third cousin, you make a chimpanzee? <laughs> yeah. Exactly. <laughs> is, that how, exactly. is that how we made them? That's how evolution works. Yeah, 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 yeah. You have sex with your third cousin and you make a chimpanzee. It's yeah. like donkeys. Like a, how do, a donkey is like a horse and a mule or something like that, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's chimpanzees. Second well, cousin, not that crazy. 3.5. Oh, oh, you you you're, you're wild. You're wild. 3.5 ain't a lot, bro. Dude. It's 97% different. So wait, what is 12.5%? That's the percent that it becomes retarded? <laughs> <laughs> like, that's the chance of the kid being retarded? I don't think I that's think so. No, no. If, a, if that 12.5% meets the kid is retarded or no? Yeah. I think the chances are actually lower than we're led to believe, to be honest with you. It no. sounds like I want to fuck all my cousins. But, <laughs> but I'm not wrong. But also, you call everyone cousins, so it's different for you guys. That's true. Yeah, everyone's a cousin. Everybody related to Indians. Yeah, exactly. There's so. a billion of us, so we're just incesting out here. You yeah. know, what can you do? Exactly. So cousins mean nothing to you. Well, no, nah, I wouldn't have sex with a cousin. <laughs> I'm Say just what? saying, I think, I saw this in Rami. The apparent, like, uh, the scientific, the science that you're going to have a retard with first cousins is yeah. blown out of proportion. Or maybe it's in his special. But blame Rami Yusuf. Wait, 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 <laughs> wait, 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 wait. What was he saying? That, like, it's not that bad. Like, yeah. the chances yeah. of being retarded. are not as high as we're led to but believe. That's most of human history, right? Mm. You had to like smash your cousin. That was just life. But do you also think that's yeah. Islam trying to take over by reducing our IQ? <laughs> <laughs> is this by making us fuck our family until our IQ is low? You're saying a reverse crusade? Yeah. yeah. Do you think that's what Rami's I, really no, trying to do? Maybe. He's, he's just saying. trying maybe. to get white people to fuck each other and black people to just Jizhan. fuck each other? No. <laughs> <Jizhan>. <laughs> So the f judge of Florida is not a Floridian <laughs> judge. This guy's crazy. I was doing bro. some googling while we were please, talking. Please, about please do it. Uh, please. Cousin, cousin sucking. You, usually before the podcast, right? Yeah. No. <laughs> what the fuck? I, I forgot we were talking about masks. Yeah, we're yeah. talking about masks. We were trying bro. to talk about important social issues. Yeah, we're right talking now. about uh, come policy. On, come on, come on. So let's she's go. a federal judge that is in Florida, not a Florida judge. Which a is federal a judge that's in Florida. Yeah, yes. appointed by Trump. How many of them do we get? How many federal judges are Talk about incest? A you got longer. districts all yourself. over the country. <laughs> Why does this one judge have so much power? Are there 50 judges and it's got to be 5149 in order to pass some shit? No, it's because someone filed a lawsuit against the government, okay. like a Health Freedom Act, something okay. like that. She's the district judge. She reviews it. I'm sorry, you knew this the whole time? 
<laughs> Where were you, bro? Wait, why are we giving us incest facts? <laughs> no, I, I'm just a smarter Googler. I just <laughs> and I, I make Yo, it look that's like that's an insult. Mark is not going to no. feel good about that. Ask me to Google anything. I'll do it right now. Go. Oh, maybe now I can confess. Uh, Remember that time I solved that riddle? Wait, what? What riddle? Remember we were doing riddles, Mark's stupid riddles? Oh, you cheated, bro? Yeah, I absolutely cheated. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's fucked up. What you riddle? Did, we would get you giving it up to him too. That he what got riddle, What riddle? What riddle? It was some riddle. I don't even remember. We were doing. Well, dumb he riddles. had some gay yeah. shit that he was doing about riddles. Why are riddles gay? It's not gay. Riddles it's just that it's clearly you didn't fuck girls. Yeah, yeah. Up. that's what I meant to say. Virgin, virgin, virgin. You doing yeah. that virgin shit? Yeah. 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 I just had to confess at some point. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Gays get ass. So gays, yeah. gays don't got time for riddles. Yeah, you sucking a nut. <laughs> That's the riddle. I really want to know what wow. the shit is. Okay, Dude, you but, really deceived us. So, bro. so Mark, so this judge shot it down. So yep. that means that we don't have any more masks on the planes. You're not required to, but a lot of people still can't. Which is fine, but you can't give me any shit. Yes. Yeah, but private airlines and airports can still require it. Oh, but pretty much, me. no, no, no. Every airport, every airline basically is like, no, nah, you don't need to. Mm -hmm. I think they were just dying for this to happen. Air, airports are at the mercy of the local government, I think. So LaGuardia and JFK, you're still supposed to? Oh, so you don't even got to do that shit at the airport? No, Most airports. Do. LaGuardia, JFK, you do. Yeah. And New York City Public Transit, you do. Because New York is, has not overturned it yet. They said they're waiting to see if Biden appeals. And if they do, then whatever. They're some cucks. But uh, pretty much everywhere else, you're mask-free in the airport and mm. on the plane. Mm. Delta dropped it. United dropped it. Uber dropped it. Lyft dropped it. We're free, baby. And the, it, like pilots came on the intercom and told everyone that people were like dancing in the yeah, aisles shit. and like throwing their masks away and like the flight attendant was coming down. Yeah, but I imagine if they were singing Easter song. <laughs> imagine the <laughs> end of the world. Yeah, bro. what a tirade some people would have. <laughs> yeah, exactly. If they believed in the Lord and Savior. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yo, Jesus Christ is so lit, dude. Wow. Oh. When did you get yeah. yeah. like, <laughs> Jesus Christ is so lit, yo, isn't yeah, it? Yo. If yo. you want Andrew to believe in God, just have an annoying atheist around him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then that easy. He'll be in church tomorrow. Yeah. That yeah. If you want Andrew to believe anything, just have an annoying opposite person. That's yeah. it. It's yeah. that simple. It's yeah. really that simple. Yeah. Yeah. I'm easily <laughs> manipulated. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like the opposite way. Whatever yeah, person's exactly. trying to mani manipulate you into, you're like, nah, fuck like that. Like if I'm somebody cares way. like deeply about something. Yeah. Ick. <laughs> Facts. Right? Like why God. you care so much, bro? Like Ow. if you just cared a little less, then I'd be like, oh, that's fire. Yeah. But I when they care that. so much. Caring too much is tough. It's especially if it's about something that doesn't like relate to them in any way. That's the worst. Yeah. When people care about just some stupid... Like, at least with religion, you're like, you get to go to heaven. Salvation. There's salvation. Like, I <laughs> yeah. get that. You're like, all right, you get some shit at the end. Mm. Yeah. But, like, fucking socialism? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I mean? What a fucking loser, right? Like, oh, wealth and quality. Right? Like, you, that, you, your whole life, fam, you gonna give it up for that? Go get a job, bro. Why don't you get a job a little bit? Do you know what I'm saying? Huh. <laughs> you talking about Jaden Smith right now, bro? Who you going Is that what he does? <laughs> yeah, that's what he said in that interview. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the yeah. social, like, political yeah. Yeah. problems of the world. Yeah, yeah, Can yeah. we talk about yeah. that? Yeah, we were dying laughing at that fucking video. Yeah. <laughs> Can we talk about Tupac's dick <laughs> going so far in your mom's pussy? No, he says vagina. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> For real though, <laughs> that is another thing that annoys me. Passionate kids, bro. Yo, yo, Just yo. enjoy toys and candy. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Fuck out of here, bro. I agree. Greta you Thunberg. Greta Thunberg. Yeah, yeah, Greta Thunberg down, like, bitch. Yeah. bitch could be right about everything, uh -huh. but you're too young. All right, guys, we're gonna take a break real quick because I need to tell you about Exter. Exter is the world's largest smart wallet brand, and I'm gonna tell you why it's the greatest wallet on earth. First of all. Quick access to all your cards. You see that? Bang. Look at that. All the cards pop out. Grab the one I need. I'm not fumbling through my wallet like a fucking idiot holding up the line behind me. Right there. Bah. Done. Which card do I need? Also, it has key tracker features, which means your wallet is trackable worldwide. This is the one wallet you will not lose. And it's voice activated. If you lose your wallet, you can just call it. It works with Google Home, Alexa, and Siri. Hey, Siri, where did my dumbass put my wallet? Because I lose it all the time. Oh, there it is. Also, this offers RFID protection, which means it protects you against identity theft and skimming. That thing that Andrew always talks about, the boop boop, where people just walk up behind you, take your fucking identity like that, 
Not with, the, not with the extra. So if you want to get an extra and improve your life, go to extra.com and use the code flagrant at checkout and you will get 20% off your order. We always look out for you at the asshole army. So go to extra, that's E-K-S-T-E-R.com and use the promo code flagrant to get 20% off site-wide. Yo, infamous tour, okay? Atlantic City sold out. Vancouver is the last place that you can come see us. That's it. That's the last place. There are two shows. They might be sold out for all I know. Just go check that shit. But that's the last time you can see the infamous tour and then it's done. Never be done again. Kind of crazy to even say that the last two shows that are potentially available, those tickets might be sold out. I'm not sure that are potentially available will be in Vancouver, Canada. Crazy. TheAndrewShows.com. Akash, what you got? First of all, I forgot to thank you guys before, but Toronto, thank you guys for selling out four shows. My first theater. So fucking hype. Can't wait to see you guys this weekend. Uh, April 28th through 30th, I'm going to be at the Stress Factory in Connecticut, the Stress Factory of Fairfield. Uh, May 12th through 14th, I'm going to be in Tacoma, Washington at the Tacoma Comedy Club. And May 19th through 21st, we're going to be in Holland, Muskegon, and Grand Rapids, Michigan. We also added a second show to Grand Rapids. Thank you guys for buying up so many tickets uh, on the Saturday show. Get those tickets and tickets for every other date I have at AkashSingh.com. Now let's get back to the show. I think it's good we're talking about this because Derek is an expert at a few things. Okay. okay. Expert at comedy, expert okay. at sports, expert at music, and an expert at movies. Okay. And that's the okay. shit y'all know, bro. I'm great at everything. <laughs> every I said it <laughs> multiple he does, times. Claim, he does claim to be great at everything. Yeah, and so yeah. far, it, it has He's worked out that good. way. But but what what why do you bring this up, Mark? Because Derek has some of the most insane movie takes I've ever heard in my life. For example. Bro, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Number one. Denzel Washington, yeah. oh, relax, is not that great of an actor. Wow, wow. he went wow. there. What you gonna do? <laughs> this is and one of the dumbest things. This is one of the dumbest wow. things I've ever heard. That's this is why kids can't talk, bro. <laughs> yeah. This is why kids can't talk because <laughs> yeah. they say stupid I wish you were Helen Keller shit. right now. I wish you were Helen Keller right now, bro. Mute, <laughs> mute. <Yeah. laughs> he can't act. No, he's back a great. It up. He, he, back it up, bro. This is he is. He's a good actor. He picks great movies. He make, he makes movies better. But the skill of acting, the skill. Is range. I don't. I don't agree with that. Range is the whole game, bro. If you gotta be able agree. to, the skill is acting. Don't agree. You, bro. He's always an angry black man, They're, no matter what. Yeah. That's why. Are the they happy? What is there to be happy about? Yeah, exactly. That was a better way to say it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is there to be happy about? Why, 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 why are you bringing yeah, that? Yeah. There's racism in the world. No, yeah. Bro, why are you bringing that? I, let me be in Gotham. Let me be in another world, nigga. Can I be in? Let me be in fucking Middle Earth. Well, I gotta be a black. Like, I wanna see you. I wanna see this nigga be retarded. I wanna see him be. I am Sam. That's what I'm saying. You remember I am Sam? Yes. That shit was crazy. Fire. That shit was crazy, bro. What's the guy? His name? He's in Ukraine. Sean Penn. Yeah. That was crazy, that movie. Yeah, it's crazy. Wasn't that crazy? That was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> crazy. Like, what are you about to say? <laughs> like, <laughs> what are you talking about? But it wasn't cr- like they were actually going to trial to see whether a fucking retard could be the, the owner of a kid. Yeah. <laughs> you don't need to go to court for that. <laughs> Why? You just go, oh, look, he's fucking retarded and maybe he can't raise his daughter. <laughs> right? Like I mean, the whole movie was like, should we or should he not? Well, you got to check, though, right? Yeah, but Britney still got her kids. Say again? Britney Spears still got her kids, though, so. I don't think she does, to be honest with you. Yeah, yeah. she still got her kids, bro. Really? Well, she's oh, allowed no. to have them. She's, she's making them. another. They're going to oh. take that one away, too, bro. I mean, they gave Damn. it to K-Fed, and he's not much more. Yeah, yeah. Not K-Fed right. is brilliant, bro. Wait, they're going to take her new kid? K-Fed a real one. They got to take her new Out, kid. Like, off rip? They must, right? No. She's crazy. <laughs> I don't think they're going to. She's not in a conservatorship anymore. They got no grounds. Oh. Yeah. So I think she gets to raise this kid and fuck it up. And then we all just get to watch it happen. This is really sad, man. I know. We made the podcast sad. I know. Jeez. Yeah. But Derek was also saying that Malcolm X, that Malcolm X was a trash movie. What? No, nah, nah, nah. Bro. He's, Yo, get he's, out. He's, he said Malcolm X that's, was a trash movie. Get out. Wild. There's no way that's a trash movie, Yo, you don't movie, like bro. black people, yo. And Training yep. Day was yep. trash. Yep. I don't like that. Yep. I don't live in New yep. York. You <laughs> don't like black people, bro. Training you, Day fire. Malcolm X fire. Bro, I don't think change the argument. I think it's a hot take. Training Day, not even close to Denzel's best work. That's not that hot of a take? Not That's even a, close. If you're a real Denzel fan, mm-hmm. not even close. Then what is? I like Malcolm X. Man on fire, Ma- bro. Man on fire is so good. So so good. I would hire Flash. Denzel to babysit Flash. my white kid <laughs> so fast, bro, after that movie, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, there's nobody on this earth that will protect your child like Denzel would. Mm. Facts. 
Man on the Crimson Tide. Book of Eli. Crimson Tide. Movie. American Gangster. All good movies. American Man. Gangster. Remember the Titans. Titans. Still, oh my Q. God. Remember the Titans. Oh, John Q. John, John Q. Q. Keep proving my point, dog. John he wasn't Q. angry what do you in mean? John Q. Yes, he is. How, yeah, how yeah, he, angry? he was, he was yes, angry. He was mad angry. He was desperate. Pursuit of happiness, bro. Will Smith. Will Smith. That was Will Smith. Dang. You remember when he slapped the shit out of his son, bro? What do you mean? He wasn't angry in Fences. <laughs> he's Bro, like, he's literally looking he's at his son going, look at me, little nigga. I didn't see I the movie. I like you. I didn't see the movie. That's <laughs> what he <laughs> says. Yeah, it's 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 crazy. Crazy. I'm not going to lie. That shit made me feel uncomfortable, bro. Really? Because yeah, he was so unlikable and I love him. And the son was like, do you even like me? And then he was like, I don't have I don't to, need like, to like, like you. you. Oh, damn. That's a angry. Right there, yeah. Philadelphia. Angry. Great, but angry. I didn't watch that shit. The range in that is Tom. I don't do that You're shit. You're crazy, bro. I'm talking about the skill, bro. I am You're crazy. Bro. Y'all talking about movies. You would come in here with a Lakers hat, bro. Like, what? Just, what? just, just, a, a, just a losing team. About. Just a losing what? team, right? What there, ang- bro. Was he angry in glory? Yeah. yeah. You don't remember him fucking getting, getting whipped and he's like. <laughs> Wait, glory? He's a, com- he's a slave? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, no, no he's, he's in the army, man. He's a slave. They literally slave whip him. Yo, 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 yo. That's crazy you think that, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, he's literally in the army, bro. bro like, slaves can be in the army, bro. Can they, though? Yeah. But they talk about how in, like, they were like, because they always say, like, man, people, uh, you know, stand up for the flag. Remember that whole Colin Kaepernick chicken? They were like, I fought for this country. And it's like, bro, plenty of black people fought for this country, even during slavery time. That yeah, but then they facts. got their freedom. But he was freed, but they still punished him. That's what the that Buffalo Soldiers using were. Using a whip. He wasn't that free. That was the Buffalo Soldiers, the black, uh, what is it called? The black, not cadets, what are the, what are the black uh, battalions. Yeah. Mm. The black battalions, they basically sent out west. No, I know he's from, yeah, my uncle's one of them. One really? Of them. Yeah. He's an actual Buffalo Soldier? Yeah, he's still like, so on the Rose Bowl Parade, bro, he, he, he still rides, he like rides with them. They do the, the Buffalo Soldiers ride through the Rose Bowl Parade every year. And he does that shit. Got, he got his own buffalo fucking horse and everything, bro. Is Just he what? like? Is he like 150 yeah, years I'm old? If I showed you a picture of Craig, I would be like, Derek, that's Just Morgan Freeman. <laughs> 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 that's how old this motherfucker is, bro. Okay, okay, okay. More trash movie takes because there's no way that yeah, Denzel. That that's trash. off. Bro, no, by trash, you mean great. absolutely correct and 100% okay, accurate. Okay, okay, go, go, go. I. Yeah. I fuck with all Judd Apatow's comedies. I do like them. Yeah. But. That is what ruined comedy movies. And Isn't that is that, why I there are this. no more. I want to hear this. I'm in okay. so far. Go on, go on this take because mm-hmm. next time I bump into uh, Judd at the cellar, I'm going to have to bring this out to him. So go on this yeah, take. He, <laughs> you made great movies, Judd. You made, you made some of the best. But you ruined comedy movies because you made it about identity and a coming of age tale. And com- comedy movies should be like seeing someone grow into this kind of whatever better person or whatever kind of person they're going to be. Fuck that. A comedy movie is. It's just like a sitcom. It's, yo, this a pet detective. Go. <laughs> you know what I mean? A, a guy with a crazy golf swing. Go. Uh, it's a fucking, it should be simple. Four guys go to Vegas, they forget everything. Go. You build out. You don't build like, let's go with the story. Like, let's go with this person and grow with them. And that's all his movies are. And they're funny. You know what I mean? The last one, what he did was like 40 year old virgin was exactly what it should have been. A 40 year old virgin. Let's go from here. That's a great, that's a great premise. And then it was like knocked up. Like, oh, what happens if you get a person knocked up? But let's see the guy grow with the girl and the girl grow with the guy. And it's like, okay, it's still funny. And then it kept going like train wreck. Let's see, or King of Staten Island, or you know what I'm saying? Like all these movies now. And that's why there's no comedy movies now. Because that's all they want. They're like, oh, well, this works. We want to see identity. We want to see someone become themselves or whatever the fuck. And it's like, mm-hmm. no, I want to see retarded dude who can hoop. Yeah. Go. <laughs> like a really hoop. Like, you know what I mean? Like. That's a comedy movie. And that's why Judd ruined comedy movies. So you wow. really think it, it, they, he ruined them? Yeah. They're never everybody's gonna make one. trying to copy him? Yes. yes. And you're like, okay, he can do it good. Yes. But mm-hmm. other people can't do it good. But everybody's modeling off of him. Yes. It's like right now with comedy in the net. She did it the best. Well, like with Jon Stewart. Yes. It's like yeah. Jon Stewart was amazing at it. Then other people tried to replicate what John Stewart did without the nuance. They're just like, I'm going to be left wing about everything, or mm-hmm. I'm going to be right wing about everything. And then the the comedy was no longer surprising. Yes. But John was actually out there doing the work. Yeah. I right. see what you're saying. Uh, that, well, I don't think he would disagree with that take, to be honest with you. Yeah. Because so I, I, I it takes a special that. skill to go on that that journey. That being said, I do like the idea that there's nothing redeeming about this character. 
Like Ugh. I think that's kind of funny. Like the pet detective thing is kind of funny. Like you solve the you solve the problem, but you don't really change the guy. He's that's still what an I, I don't want to grow with him. That's yeah, what, yeah, that's what that. I'm saying. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah. want to see the four guys figure out what the fuck they did in Vegas last night, and and then still be that way. Even yeah. Happy Gilmore grew, but it didn't matter that he grew. He like learned to control his temper a bit. You learn how to like... putt, bro. That's not growing. <laughs> 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 the whole big montage, he's like, learn how to putt, mm-hmm. and he's at the, and it's literally about learning how to putt. No, nah, but he don't fuck people up anymore and all that shit. So he's a little oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's not about the growth. Yes, yeah. it's not about that. It's about yeah. this that's crazy a, That's swing. a byproduct of the script just getting to its end place. Hmm. So that's why you'll never see another comedy movie. It's over. Just then never Hangover, seen Hangover was the last great comedy movie we'll ever see. Really? We'll never see another one. We'll ever see? We will never see another one. In 20 years? You know, no. Someone's going to be like, oh, let's write something funny? Bro, we're going, we're leaning more into identity. Yeah, and identity's not funny. No, no, that's not true. The, I Am Sam 2 is coming out. And, <laughs> you know, I Am Sam you? 2. So it's, what's the sequel? Nice, what's the sequel, bro? bro? He's, he's in bobsledder. And he, they don't even use the bobsled. They just... They roll them down. <laughs> and it is crazy, bro. It is wild, dude. You guys got to check out I Am Sam 2 coming to the theaters. Jeez. I also wonder if like TikTok and other like external content has made like funny movies less interesting. Yeah. Why? You know what I mean? Like you're able just to get your fix as far as like laughter. And it's like if I'm going to go to a movie, I want like big multi-million dollar cinematics, like theatrics. I want CGI and the whole deal. And that's what you're paying for. It and sale. I think a lot of the talent is going that way. And they're like, I'll just make my own shit, make a ton of money and have complete control over everything. Yeah. So they're not as cultivated in this. I will say one funny comedy surprising surprised me was Girl Strip. Tiffany Haddish is so fucking funny in that movie mm. that it carries the whole thing. Every line. Bang, bang, bang. But yeah. she is the only part of it that's like that. The rest of the movie, the girls are all like growing to be better yeah, women. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Tiffany Haddish carries it over the top. She does. So fuck. If you haven't seen it, it's your. I'm so impressed. Every line she makes funny. Every yeah. fucking line. Mm. Yeah, she yeah. made that movie a hit. No, no yeah. question. You might be right because I'm looking mm-hmm. at this list. Top five or the top comedy movies of the last five years. Number one is Personal History of David Copperfield. Kill yourself. <laughs> Love Simon. Into the Spider Verse. What is this? NPR. Into the. <laughs> yeah. right, this is ScreenRant.com. The funniest comedy films for the last five years. I can't. I can't. What find... are the highest grossing? Let's look up highest grossing. I'll look that that'll up. tell you something. Because the people speak louder than the critics. Yeah. So, so far, you're one for one. Okay. Well, no, I'm two. I'm two, one bro. For two the, buddy. You guys changed the Denzel one argument one in the middle of the argument. One, one take, you can one and one. One, one and one. one. Yeah, yeah, one and one. one. Not one for one. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. See why I was... <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was... That's the worst fucking number two. That's fucking number two. That's two. See why I was impressed earlier? It's not racist. It's just like, I know this good. man. I knew what the fuck I was talking about. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. we're definitely two and up. Mark, next. What are we talking about? Hold on, hold on. You got another, you got another movie take? <laughs> oh, bro. I can go all day. Uh, this guy. This this him. Yeah. Marvel Infinity War is the greatest movie ever made. Not superhero movie, not fucking any uh it's the uh, put it up against anything. It's the number one movie the one and it's the four. peak of cinema, and they will never make anything better. There will never be a better movie experience, there'll never be a better overall story, there'll never be a better anything. This is the one before Endgame, or are you including before Endgame? Endgame? No, I do not include Endgame. Endgame is just a superhero movie. I this agree is a, with that. Infinity War is a movie. Two and it's three. better than Shawshank, it's better than fucking name a movie, bro. It, I, nothing I, I, the Oof. prequel to I Am Sam is <laughs> literally one of the oh, best. I'm movies. going to be Sam. I'm going yeah, to be I Sam. Be Sam. That's an awesome Bro, movie. And when you see that retarded <laughs> sperm swim back in his dick, and you're like, what are you doing? Like, it is, it is pretty fucking special, that yeah. movie. You got to see that shit. <laughs> that is. That Wait, is the thousand of sperm is swimming? Yeah. Is that dude. the horn of the two cousins fucking? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, it's 12 and a half percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> okay, but uh, Infinity War is. The first part of Endgame. the the Avengers, the la- the final Avengers, which is Infinity War Endgame, and the reason it's the best movie of all time, start start at the end. They lose. That's what makes it already top top notch. Oh, that's why yeah. it's already up there with The Departed or other things, you know, Reservoir Dogs or movies like that, Pulp Fiction, where it's like nothing. There's no winner. Nobody wins. The best movie can't you can't win. You can't walk out feeling good. You got to walk out feeling. You got to walk out thinking. You know what I'm saying? In, in Infinity War, you cry. It starts amazing. There is no breaks. They they exactly pace it. It's the most. It's the best paced movie I've ever seen in my life. In the first five seconds of the movie, the Hulk is getting his ass beat. Mm. The Hulk. So you're already like, whether you know anything about superheroes or not, you know oh, like, no, oh, that's no, the, the Hulk. beginning is fire. That's the Hulk. No, I know the he's the strongest. Is fire. Yeah, when, yeah. when Thanos gets fucked up a little bit and then a guy's gonna step in, he goes, no, no, let him have his fun. He goes, yeah, that's yeah, what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, that's yeah, fire. That yeah. line. Infinity you're like, so fire. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. There's never been a better movie, and there never will be. Two for three. Three for three, but yeah. <laughs> you just, you're convinced now? Best movie ever? Wait, I'm trying to think best movie yeah. ever. Is that better than Shawshank Redemption? Absolutely. He wins. Shawshank Does he, is though? great. 
His with. whole life he spends getting he, butt uh, fucked. He, yeah, he got fucked by dudes many yeah. times. Yeah, that's a tough. And win. then his his like his gritty. Some would say the, like the final <laughs> outcome is like he's got to live in Mexico on a boat, and he swam through actual doo doo to get there. Yeah, yeah, all that all that's great, but you don't cry. You didn't cry, Ooh. Shawshank. You don't cry, Shawshank. Ooh. Ooh. You don't cry, bro. Who, about? Who's, yeah, you're, um, bro. Who when he reveals that he he broke out, you're not like. <gasps> Like you're, you're not crying. Son, you're just like this up. is awesome. I stood up. I'm watching the fucking room, uh, the movie by myself, like a loser. Stood up, raised my arms, like a biggest dork. That's on earth. not crying. That's the same feeling that Rudy gets you. That's winning. It's a movie. Rudy. A movie. <laughs> <laughs> makes you yeah, stood yeah. up and just put your hands up like Rocky. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I, celebratory. I was like, yo, I'm not having sex for a but long wait. time, but this is so <laughs> fire. That's but exactly this is so what fire. Happened. But what part? What part? When you when he gets free and you see like how it all happened, you're like, oh, this motherfucker. But were you just excited that he was swimming through shit? Like it was something relatable to you? Like. Slumdog worth it. Yeah, you did get that autograph. So, okay. like, The Godfather like, is not better than The Godfather? No, no, no. no, no, no. no, no. Godfather's great, but no, there, Infinity War is the greatest movie of all time. Because you cry, bro. Spider Man dies. You start crying for yeah. everyone in the theater. Also, yeah, yeah. I include theater experience. Mr. Stark? <laughs> Mr. Stark, I don't feel oh, so good. Shit, don't I don't feel do that, that shit don't hit me. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. You see Robert Downey like, oh, look, I shit. can't save him. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh, boy. Spoiler alert. Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> spoiler alert. Right. Motherfucker. Mark hadn't seen this. I didn't read that Wikipedia yet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> also, bro, yeah, your movie doesn't even count, bro. If there's fucking like, oh, there was 13 people in the theater. Shut the fuck up. Sold out. Five, seven weeks in a row, every seat filled, everybody reacting the same way. That is an experience. That was a fucking movement, bro. Like Infinity War. And, and, and Endgame's only ever like, oh, Endgame. That's only because of Infinity War. That's that, that was just, you You are, you had to like, you came and you already have to like, you know. Or actually, no. Infinity War is all the fucking and Endgame's coming. Mm. The best part is, I mean, it actually depends what you like. But I like the fucking part. <laughs> I like to fuck. No, I like you the know fuck. what I mean? Coming and it's over. Yeah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So that's why Infinity War, it's just pound for pound the greatest movie ever made. Okay. Okay. Mm. Acting cast. The cast is insane. I mean, bro, it's perfect. Jeez. Do you think it has good representation for minorities and disabled people? And <laughs> dude, Black Panther's in it. Captain Marvel's in it. One black dude, a retarded bitch. That's come on, <laughs> come on. She shouldn't be me in it, but I'll let her be in it. I'll let her in this. Wait, why is she retarded? I don't think she's in it till Endgame, right? Oh, actually, you're right. She's not in Infinity War. Yeah, that's why it's so good. <laughs> that's why it's a perfect fucking movie, dog. <laughs> that's why it's perfect. Okay, Mark, what else you got? Oh, th there was one more movie thing we were arguing about in Pittsburgh. I forgot okay. what it was. Is that Brad Pitt was hotter than who was the other person? Do you remember? Miles. Oh, Leo. You 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 rank Leo way too high. Well, Leo's the greatest actor of all time. Oh, and it's not God. even close, guys. I'm oh four for four again. God. Not even close. Wait, 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 wait. What's his this will range? be the last one because I'm. Oh, yeah, Leo is right. Leo's the definition of range. Okay, he, just, he just walk me through. Let's start going. Just walk me What's eating Gilbert Grape? What does he have? The Denzel. Yeah, but he was a child retard. It's the Cuba. same thing. That's even harder. And Cuba. he was an adult in real life. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. Cuba. <laughs> Cuba. <laughs> Cuba. <laughs> range. This range. is all he did to that's be retarded. He just found that retarded people flick their fingers like that. That's not hard. Cuba. But they do. Gilbo, can you carry mom downstairs? <laughs> hey, Gilbo. That's pretty good. Hey, That's really that, good. Hey, Gilbo. Good. Hey, Gilbo. You're, you've Gilbo. been a great actor this whole time. Yeah, I actually yeah. know how to act retarded. You can only like do one role. You can yeah. only do one role, though. Uh -huh. Hey, Gilbo. Mom became part of the band. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Gilbo. I'm trying to peel mom off the bed, but she don't come off the bed. <laughs> It's like trying, it's like trying to get a fruit roll up off of this tickle. <laughs> Gilbo, Gilbo, you're just typecast as Down syndrome. Yeah, I have to do that. That'd be fire. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So then, why is he the best actor? Right. That was so easy what I just did. That he's a slave owner, which is the greatest slave owner of all time. He made slave owning cool. Uh, <laughs> he made it cool. He made it, bro. You watch Django. I'm not rooting for nobody but Calvin, dog. I root for Calvin. <laughs> Calvin <laughs> Candy. Derek, please. Calvin bro. Candy, Come dog. On, bro. I don't fuck, you don't tell me, bro. Don't be like, oh, he black. I guess not, nigga. I like Calvin. You watch that. Friend, don't tell me you watch Django. And when the first hour to have the movie is great, when he comes on screen, that's when you tuned in. That's when you like black or white. That's when you lock the fuck in, dog. That's when Calvin got on stage. It was, but it wasn't. It did, the stakes got real. Yeah, when that, that motherfucking red coat showed up, boy, you see him turn around and look at the camera. And he's fucking like, you know what I mean? And there's two niggas just fighting, and he's like, <laughs> Bro, out of here, out of here. <laughs> this is old Ben. Damn. Like all of it's fire. Okay. <laughs> Damn. Dude, he's been the wolf. On, son. 
The Wolf. Of, of Wall, Wall Street? Street? Yeah. And he was the Wolf. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Good. Should have won the Oscar for that one. Departed his range, bro. You believe he's a fucking uh, undercover Once cop? Once time in Hollywood, he's great. Oh, my God. Just a fucking failed actor? I mean, come on. Denzel could never. I love you, Den. I love <laughs> you, bro. But you're going to have to be a retard getting eaten by a bear slave on him, bro, Maybe before I put you up here with him. Before I put you up here with him. That would be a fire movie. Bro. Maybe fire. they don't uh, give those roles to black people. Oh, mm. shit. That's a different argument. I'm not, hey, I'm not talking mm. about the system. I'm talking about what it is. Oh, we don't shit, know what Denzel nah. is Let's capable go, of. We don't know what he's no, also, of. I disagree because Denzel, you're Denzel Washington. You have the fucking prowess to pick all these roles over a lot of these fucking white dudes who get it. There are some movies for sure Denzel could get before Christian Bale if he wanted. I think Denzel knows, nigga, I don't know how to be a crackhead boxer. Mm. I just think, I think Denzel knows his you lane. You think Denzel could have played the fucking brother in that movie. No, I'm saying you he couldn't. You think Denzel could have played Mark Wahlberg's sibling <laughs> if he wanted to? Yeah, he could have. He's Denzel. They're going to listen. They're going to take the meeting. It's, it's still a true that. story. It's 50%, yeah. 50%, it's 50% it's like genetics, all right? It could happen. You never know. But yeah, he, he ain't picking, Denzel ain't picking them out of his range box, which is smart. Mm. But that's why I'm, I'm sorry, bro. You got to be to be up there with fucking Leo. It goes Leo, Christian Bale, Dale Day. You can switch Dale Day, Christian Bale, depending on how you feel. But that's the that's the three. Daniel Day got range. They, that's is yeah. Inside man, Denzel not angry. He's Yo, just inside smart, man, he's, he's a, just a smart racing guy. He is smart. Yo, Denzel's the man, dude. I'm sorry. Guy. I think he's Denzel the got it. It's the greatest of all time. Because what he does is so great. Because what he does, it's like Steph Curry can't really get to the basket that well, right? He can't dunk. He shoots the best yes he doesn't defend that well but he shoots the best and then because he shoots the best he uses that to make everything else he does that much better so he can get to the basket because he can get guys to bite for the jump tom brady he elevates everything around him no we're wrong he just does one thing incredibly well exactly tom brady can't scramble he no. got no pocket movement denzel's mm -hmm. aaron Rodgers. like no tom brady's leo <laughs> no. <laughs> that's it no you say that diversity and skill is what makes someone a good actor yes well, Tom Brady ain't got that. He got the one skill. No, Tom Brady's skill is I am the best football player ever. But Aaron Rodgers can run. He can throw. He could do it all. Aaron Rodgers can pick but up he's 12 yards on third and 11, no problem. Tom Brady not doing also, that. Also, football and acting is different, right? Hey, Definitely not. I'm going to live in this. I'm going to yeah. live in this and still win it. Yeah, yeah. I'm still going to win it. What the fuck is that? Right, what the fuck is he doing? I'm just saying, right? Like, it's not that different, though. It's not that different. Shut up. It's not that different. It's not that different, bro. I guess it's the same. I'm sorry, bro. Leo's the GOAT. Mm -hmm. This guy, bro. Dale Day and Christian Bale, this and guy, it's bro. simple, and it's because of range. And a goat is Tom Brady. That's what I'm saying. Like, cause you're like, oh, he's Steph, and it's like, I'll, I'll give you that. Denzel is Steph, but LeBron or Michael LeBron is Leo. Daniel Day is not in my top five, yeah. bro. What? He's that? just doing this to be because I don't like. No, no. I'll be honest. I like actors that I can see them in the role. That's why I like Denzel because I I think it's Denzel. I don't think he's playing a character. That is Denzel. <laughs> Like Denzel so, is that guy. So you like bad actors? He likes not actors. actors. No, no, no. You know know what you're supposed to do? He can't Thank act, you. so he likes actors yeah. who don't act. Who else is in your top five? Nicolas Cage. <laughs> Nicolas Cage. Yo, okay, so wait a minute. That's, Nicolas that's Cage. Point. <laughs> Nicolas Cage. That's your top yeah. two, baby. Nicolas Cage. This is probably the greatest American actor alive Number three, right now. Michael Jordan in Space Jam. <laughs> yeah, Michael Jordan. And then also Bugs Bunny. Number four, too. Samuel L. Jackson. <laughs> and, uh, Samuel well, L. Jackson is not that good, bro. Sam, I don't like Samuel L. Jackson. Tarantino said he's maybe the best actor he's ever worked with, I think, about Samuel L. Jackson. At what? Son, I don't know. Tarantino said that shit, though. And that's, you be saying shit. <laughs> I don't disagree with you. To be honest. You just be saying shit. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not wrong. Whatever black guy lets me say the N-word a lot. Yeah, yep. he's the best actor ever. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, yep. Just be saying that shit, right? Like, come on. No, I think <clears throat> Daniel Day-Lewis, I don't know who he is, which I'm sure you like. I don't like that. Mm. So I don't need to see the Daniel Day-Lewis movie. But if Denzel's in some shit, I'm like, ooh, we got two hours of Denzel into it i kind of feel that way about leo a little bit i'm like okay i like this yo george clooney love it yeah he's fire he's great he's got some range but i like the man bro oceans 11 <laughs> that, I get you, you like a motherfucker dude who's, I'm, he's the man every I movie i like the man bro I give me see, the hero i want to see a hero of the next movie he's a bitch no. that's what i like i'm like oh look at this, I just, look at this bitch ass motherfucker I can't, I can't. also another reason denzel not funny leo's funny and to be funny, it to me is the hardest kind of acting there is. Yes, comedic acting is by far the hardest. That's why none of them can do it. And well, the motherfuckers that can be funny, you can't pretend to be funny. You can can't. pretend to do everything else. You can you pretend to be sad. You can pretend to be happy. You can pretend to do. You can't pretend to be funny. You can't pretend good timing, bro. Yeah, you're either funny impossible. or you're not funny. Yep. Simple as that. Like, dude, there are guys like. How do you feel about Jack Black as a comedic actor? 
Top five. Dude, like he's unbelievably funny. Yes. Like he just is funny. He knows how to be funny. He oozes funny. Like and maybe it's, you know, career choices, these types of things, but he has almost like that um Jim Carrey thing where he can make things that aren't funny funny just by either physicality or delivery or all these things. That is fucking hard, bro. bro uh, no lines. Here, ten minutes in a scene, no lines, be funny. And have the house dying. He could do it. Impossible. That's and that's why it makes it so uh, that's incredible though. Yeah. That's incredible. Okay. Mark, what else we got? There's there's one other movie genre that Derek likes. What is it? That uh What's that it? we talked about before, if you're cool. Oh, the greatest movie. genre in film. The stuff yeah, you yeah. just watched up there? Yeah. No, it's, it's, no, it's, that's it's, men. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's fucking what was it, Pittsburgh? Like, yeah. Is that the Pittsburgh thing? Uh, kind of, kind of. Kinda. But what, what's your favorite? Because he asked a second ago, he's like, are men done? It's like, no, men will never be done. Women, you're out of here. <laughs> why, why is that? They're replaceable. Why? Because tranny porn. Oh. Tranny porn. <laughs> wait, wait. Trannies? <laughs> <laughs> the greatest thing to ever happen. Derek's <laughs> favorite genre of film is trans yes, porn. That. Trans, po tranny porn, I call it. But yeah. Tranny porn, I call it. <laughs> yeah, that's the greatest thing ever. And you can say that because no. you're into it. Love it. Okay. I love it, bro. I watched that Why shit. Why do you like, you know, explain what the... You know, <laughs> kiss my girl on the mouth, nigga. Right after I come, I kiss Sam right on the mouth, dog. Short time. Yeah, Derek's girl is here, by the way. So we got to get her perspective. <laughs> like, is that why you don't want to call her Samantha? You want to call her Sam? Sam. Hey, yo. <laughs> Sometimes I call her Samson, nigga. When I'm, when I'm hey, it. Samuel. Get over here. <laughs> <laughs> no way! No, I love Tranny Point. I fuck with that shit. The no. long, long okay. way, the strong way. The long way, really. Yeah, the, sure. <laughs> the strong way. Yeah, sure. Okay, okay, okay. Now, why, why? Now we've talked about this before. But why, yeah. wh why do you love Tranny Point so much? It is. We all watch porn, yeah, and yeah, it's yeah. the best of both worlds. It is yeah, the reason yeah. we, we all don't watch porn. use your hands like it's art. Well, because I have to let you guys know. <laughs> like, uh, I don't want people thinking this is hate speech. Like, no, no bro, really? I thought about this. I wrote it down. Okay, okay, <laughs> this okay, is all okay, scientific. Go, 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 go. Uh, Why do you we all watch porn. Look at Al's face, bro. Al, Al, you watch so, porn. Al, do you watch porn? So this is worse than your Denzel right now. Because <laughs> it's right. I'm sorry. I'm right all the time, my nigga. <laughs> Damn. Okay, go, go. Okay, go. We all watch porn. Two reasons for both genders. P basic. With the guy, he's got to be in shape, and he's got to have a leg of a dick. Period. You don't want to see no meat. No one might want to see no jiggling, and you don't want to see no small dick. Period. Point blank. With the woman, she's got to be a bad bitch, fat ass, nice titties. And tranny porn has found a way to like Dragon Ball Z, go tanks that shit, and <laughs> and fuse the best of both worlds. So, okay. <laughs> okay, so you got so you got a big titties, good shape. But oh, also big dick. Huge. Uh, a small dick, that's gay. I don't watch that. <laughs> so, 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 if she's got a small dick, I'm like, get this little dick nigga out of here, bro. You're not even a woman. <laughs> <laughs> You're not even a fucking woman, You call yourself a woman with that dick? Yo, you you call yourself a woman, bro, with your soft ass? No, nah, bro, you gotta be hard dick, <laughs> leg up, titties out, and a bad bitch. And I'm, I'm all in. Men are done, bro. <laughs> no, no, no. So, 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 if there's a guy, for example, that's into oh, tranny fuck. porn, but it's with smaller dicks, what do you think about them? That's fucking gay, bro. You want to see small? Who wants to watch porn and see a flaccid small dick? A flaccid small dick is kind of disgusting. Yeah, yeah. When you yeah. see it on camera, it's fucking disgusting. Yeah, and you see it like getting fucked and it's flopping. It's like I'm already gross now. You make that shit this. <laughs> a little different. And it looked like this. Now I'm like, wow. This is artistic. <laughs> yes. This is kind of beautiful. Okay, it's okay. like when you see those paintings in front, you know what I mean? Like of, of a naked people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, this is beautiful. Now, how did you break this down to, to your girl? I told her, hey, I like training porn. Actually, no. She saw me uh, go on stage once and... It was like 30 minutes of me talking about how great it was. <laughs> <laughs> and she was just like, oh, that's what you're doing in there? Sam, that's when you found out? <laughs> yeah, she found, she, yeah so she found out she saw a set one night and was like, that's what he's doing. Because <laughs> she knows I'm in that bathroom, bro, but you know, that's my time. <laughs> I let her watch her shows. When she's watching Bridgerton, I don't say shit, nigga. I don't say a fucking word. Bridgerton, I let her watch Bridgerton. That's, that's her. That's her. That's too, nigga. Well, yeah, but at least the shit I watch is good. <laughs> The shit I watch get views. I mean, Bridgerton gets views, but not the views I'm talking about. Wait, what kind of numbers are you talking, putting up? I'm talking, nigga, 25 mil every yeah. bid. He's watching every yeah. bid, bro. He's watching Mrs. Beast. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, oh. No. Yo. No. That's hilarious, bro. Okay. There's okay. always, always something with you okay. comments. Wait, so, uh, you comments uh, always got something. Sorry, I have to ask this question. Uh, now, am yeah. I the only one in this room? Be honest fucking with me, dog. Yeah. Yes. Who's watched that shit? Yes. Al, we know you're lying. But so, anybody else? No, no, I, no, I, no you no, don't no, watch. No. I believe it. No, no, no. <laughs> I believe I've watched a trans woman fuck a woman. That's what he likes, I think. I like that, too. No. No, like, no, 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 I know what Akash yeah. thought. I know what Akash thought. He thought it was a trans woman with... fucking a woman. So he was like, oh yeah, I guess that's just like, like the that, old joke. Yeah. That's just more tits. Yeah. It's the yeah, same shit, more tits. No, no. He likes. I've that's never lesbian. struggled with mental yeah. math so much in my life trying to put this together. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Go, go, okay. go, 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 go. So go, tell go. me what it is. Yeah, yeah. What, what are is, all the parts? What are all the parts? It's who's, yeah. I like a male that is not a man, trans. a porn star, a dude. Yeah. In shape, huge dick. Fucking. A beautiful woman. With a vagina resting on top, or with a dick resting on top? With a big titties and also a huge dick. And that is the kind of porn that I start my day with. Wait, so there's two dicks in this scene? Yeah, a man and a woman. <laughs> <laughs> God, no. <laughs> y'all, bro, y'all niggas in the, in the past, bro. No. But y'all, y'all were playing Nintendo. I'm on. Fuck, I got an Oculus on. Hey, yo, yeah. explain, you might be right about this. Explain it to Al to really get Al to no, understand no, the joy it. of it. No, because no, right. you're not getting and it. Keep it in the wild. <laughs> yeah. Explain the joy of it. Because you're thinking What's it's the gross. Joy? Yeah, yeah. Explain the. It's joy. not gross. Yeah, yeah. If you're thinking about a nigga that looks gross. like me with a wig on, that is gross and gay. There has to be a beautiful woman, just like all porn. Mm. Has to be a beautiful woman. Mm. She also has to have a gigantic penis. But why? Because <laughs> that's really because I, I believe in women. <laughs> I believe in their rights to have fun and oh, do whatever they want. Human rights? Oh, I'm sorry, Al. Al doesn't believe in human rights. No, <laughs> I bro. <broke. laughs> Apparently, I don't. What do you mean? You can come on. Don't so wait, wait, Al. If it's a beautiful woman, right? Everything yeah. about her is a woman. Everything's beautiful. <laughs> Shut and up, then you stop. get down to the pussy, but instead of a pussy, it's a baton. <laughs> that's weird to you. But you got so many options, though, on like to pull yeah, up. Yeah, there's shit. white ones and black ones and Asian no. ones. And, yeah, <laughs> all kinds of options. Well, you said huge dick Asians out the window. <laughs> oh my no, God. bro, they packing. I've, I've seen it. Yeah, yeah, they're up. So wait, Al, that would be weird for you? It's just not my cup of tea of porn. Have you That's watched it? Ever? But is, let's say, for no. example, you're seeing a straight porn star male suck a beautiful woman's huge dick. I'm cool. Even Sam into that. That's kind of hot. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't gay. It ain't gay, bro. You suck at a woman's dick. That's as straight as you can do it. That's the straightest way to suck dick, I think. Maybe, that's, maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm crazy for thinking of straight ways to do it. Is this a bit though? Nah, this is, <laughs> nah, this I'm lie about it, bro. I'm always right. <laughs> I said it. I'm always right. I'm good at everything. Now, has this created any issues in your guys' relationship? Is there? Do you ever worry, Sam, about uh, uh, not being able to fulfill yeah. his desire? Yeah, you don't I have enough dick for this guy. So <laughs> no, no, no. I hope I can't fulfill his desires. I'd rather him, you know, wear himself out in the morning. <laughs> bro, that's oh, she loves. Oh, 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 you need it too much. So you need it too much. Yes. You need a nut every single day. I nut. Oh, yeah. Twice a day minimum. Minimum. Bare minimum. And then the other, other days, depending on the day. How much time I have and how much fun the day has been. Yeah, comics, bro. Wow. Yeah, and I support that. Oh, yeah. Wow. And you support. Straight what do you mean by you support that? Like. You keep nutting. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I come out the bathroom, wait, relax, chill. Wait, I this, hug her. I don't attack her. So he's been. <laughs> Question, question, There's question. There's no attacks in the morning, dog. She knows what it is. Question, this might be a little too much, but then would you prefer if she wears a strap on? 
No, that's gay. Why are you making it gay? Why are you making it so gay? Yeah, yeah, that's like, gay. I'm you're recreating this guy. homosexual. I'm recreating nah, bro. bro. I'm not going to lie, dude. I'm recreating You're the fucking th gay, son. Yeah. Yeah. Yo. Yo, the way it's you funny. ask questions is wild gay. Finally. <laughs> yeah. Finally, you guys. Finally. Thank you. I've been trying to come out all this time. Derek, I feel you, dog. I feel you, <laughs> he was getting yeah, mob on the day, bro. <laughs> okay, go, 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 go. Ask your question. No, that was the question. Ask your gay ass question. That was the question. Said, because it recreates that scene. What? Oh, the strap on. No, but yeah, he, yeah. he doesn't want to get no, fucked. No, I'm fucking. No, I'm not saying he he's getting fucked, but just she just wears it just for the heck of it. That's oh. weird. That's no, like but a that's blue lightsaber scene. in the room. <laughs> yeah. no. hey, you can get a black one. I want white. flesh. What yeah. if Sam said, I want to get a surgery so that I can have a penis? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. What and now? you got to help her pick out the penis. Oh. It would at least be a discussion. <laughs> <laughs> no, I gotta have this. no. Oh, like, I gotta have baby. This is the problem. The this is the real problem, yeah. ladies. The moment we really learn how to impregnate these nigga bitches, <laughs> you're out. Yeah. You're extinct. Dinosaurs. Oh, Dinosaur yeah. bitches. All of you, bro. You think I'm not putting a baby in that shit. fucking thing? <laughs> this is, this the crazy. fucking hand-eye coordination he'll have and the the, the balance. So you're saying vaginas <laughs> are like flip phones. So we're just waiting for the technology bro, to catch we're waiting up. For the techno bro, Elon, fuck Twitter, nigga. Figure out <laughs> how we can put a baby in these nigga bitches. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> No. <laughs> I don't got nothing. So, so, what you're saying is, if Sam could have a penis and still produce a child. Oh my God. <laughs> you know, but you can't. You know, uh, what's that? Rolling Stones. You can't always get what you want. You know? <laughs> and that's what that song's really about. Is. No! <laughs> oh, shit. Oh shit! <laughs> oh my god! Holy fuck! Oh, honestly, bro, Miles, can we pull up a video? I just can we watch uh, one? Did y'all just see it? Yeah, make and out watch it. Make out watch it. Understand what, what, what I was oh, proposing? <laughs> I got some fire ones, bro. I pull up. I pull up a bitch. You gonna be like, that's Doja Cat? I'm like, I told you, it's not Doja Cat. But imagine, no, if Doja good, Cat had the I biggest like... dick you've ever seen. <laughs> How many I inches feel, are we would, talking no, about? I would feel differently. Oh, about we're talking Dodger like this, this ten, eight, ten inches porn dick. Eight, eight, nine up. Porn is eight, eight or eight and a half up. That's porn. But it just doesn't get any use. It just swings there. Like, why do you want to see it? It's exciting. It's a sword in the room. There's something else deadly in the room. You know what I mean? It's something else that can cause problems. It's, 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 it's like, whoa, this shit, you know what I mean? Two, two is better than one, that's why. I like, yeah, more. I like more everything. More everything on earth. I can't believe y'all don't like it. Stop fucking crying. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Miles, go ahead and pull that video. I, 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 I think we can rap. Put that little baby dick That's right not there, what I'm dog. talking about. Yeah. But you see the body? That's, now put a huge dick on that where it's out the screen <laughs> and you're like, whoa. See, yeah. <laughs> Alex, I'll just look at him. Just I'll look at him. just look at him. Oh, that's, uh, that's Daisy Taylor. I know her. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Hey, you don't like Daisy, bro? Yeah. Shout out Daisy, oh, nigga. Daisy's also oh. asshole oh. <laughs> I I bet. <laughs> Vala's into it. Yeah, Vala's into it. Vala, you in, bro? Don't be, don't Vala let these niggas shame you. <laughs> Look at this girl. <laughs> women. <laughs> I support women, bro. Just, I'm, I love them. Wow. Feminist. They do look like women. <laughs> they're, they're, it's like the Cree in Marvel, bro. You don't know what's what anymore. <laughs> Everybody could be anybody at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all niggas better get in the future, dog. I'm here. I'm, in, I'm here. I'm in the future, bro. Oh, wow. You think Elon Musk is I'm trying to analyze something here. Nah. You watch <laughs> porn. You're watching a a guy with a dick, straight porn. So you are watching a dick. Yeah. You're watching a girl with pussy and tits. Mm -hmm. Is it no more gay to watch that? You're just watching it together. Yeah. You ever watch, you remember back in the, in the DVD? Oh, but there's no pussy. Yeah. 
Yes, there is. <laughs> That's what makes it gay. There's no pussy. Is. <laughs> Dude, once, okay, let me, let me explain to you guys science. Okay, once a woman <laughs> yeah, yeah. has a penis, her vagina is now her butthole. <laughs> <laughs> so she poops out of her vagina? Yeah. Oh. They're just, they're different. It's, a, it's like a new, it's like a new being. <laughs> it's like a new animal. Oh, That's it's, what, it's, like a butterfly. Just, it's just a new yeah, it's a new thing that y'all aren't ready for. Not, I'm not ready. Well, so, okay, yeah. so another question right, I'm ready. curious about is do you have any interest in living out these fantasies? Would, like if you were not in a committed relationship, would you yes. be with a trans woman? No, no, I'm scared. It's like the subway. It's like nigga, once it gets real, it's like, oh, this is real now. You know what uh, I mean? Once you see that long, <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> That's when it's real. So no, what I'm would good. you what would be the safest environment? Would you would you do like I don't know some activities with one. You do jujitsu or something like that. Like, <laughs> <laughs> get my ass beat. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna red choke light. you out yeah. twice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Go out there, and put a red light on both your balls, bro. That'd be, <laughs> yeah. that'd be great. No, but what, what would you do that? Is there like a baby steps into if this? I, bro, because I'm I'm marrying that little motherfucker over there. So if I was oh. single, I would probably. I couldn't, I couldn't, I, everything else would be too scary. I mean, if, if one of them like were to suck my dick and while she's sucking my dick, she pulled out her huge dick, I'd probably be like, wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow. This is not gay. <laughs> this is a woman. And, I and I'd probably, I look at her and I go, I respect you. And kiss her on the forehead. Yep. Which wow. head, yeah. And I'd be, like, <laughs> <laughs> and I'd be like, I think you deserve so, more I money. I thought you meant which, like, W-I-T-C-H. I was like, you. Which <laughs> head? <laughs> okay, um, Al, any final thoughts? Nope. Have you been turned? <laughs> nah, nope. I'm good. You're you not even going to watch up? it? I'm just not. I'm like, I'm a dinosaur. You know, I like that old-fashioned <laughs> shit. You know? <laughs> Why don't you want this to be real? <laughs> don't, you like, don't you like something that maybe he's not into? Possibly. You, you like DMX and shit? <laughs> yes, uh, yeah. fuck all that, bro. That's the equivalent. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What is some thing that maybe Al would be into that you'd be like, no, nah, that's crazy. Like, you know that disgusting straight porn? That shit is. Ugh. Well, no, you like straight porn. I like straight porn too. Yeah. Oh, you can't just watch straight porn. Then it's then it's not. You know, it's just like anything. It's like food. It's like dessert. It's like dessert, bro. I'm not gonna eat ice. Just ice. So you don't cream. start with that. You, you work up to it. No, he starts out in the morning. Yeah. yeah. But is that the first thing you look at, or are you like, oh, I'm gonna look at? Oh no! It just depends on what I feel like jerking off to. It's like, do I want to? Do I want to just come or do I want to come? Oh. If I want to come, nigga. I know what porn I'm cutting off. <laughs> you know, but if I want to just right. nut, you want to enjoy yourself. But if you're trying to spin the whole block, bro, if I'm trying to. <laughs> if I'm trying to shoot the bathroom up, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The bathroom is a massacre. You know, yeah. like who was in here? Then yeah, then I'm, I'm cutting. Guys, this has been flavored yeah. too. Yeah. 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 A long time ago. This is Derek Poston. Make sure you find him. Damn. Listen to his podcast. Spoil Jack. the beans. T spoil the beans. Great podcast. And also find him on all social media. You can see him on the Infamous Tour. And uh, I'm sure you guys will see a lot more of him. Thank you guys so much for listening. Thank you for coming on, Derek. Thanks for having me. Peace. Man.